Welcome to A Bill a Minute from GovTrack, your 60-second breakdown of interesting bills in Congress. I'm Jesse Rifkin. The Federal Production Tax Credit, or PTC, for renewable energy projects was originally created by Congress in 1992 and scheduled to expire in 1999, but Congress extended it 12 times. Uh, the most recent time was a one-year extension in December 2019, passed by both a Democratic House and a Republican Senate. It's currently scheduled to expire on New Year's Eve 2020. But should Congress extend it for a lucky number 13th time? Well, the PTC Elimination Act says no, no more, and would officially end the federal production tax credit for renewable energy projects starting in 2021. The House version was introduced by Texas Republican Representative Kenny Marchant, while the Senate version was introduced by Oklahoma Republican Senator James Lankford. Now, supporters argue that the legislation would save an estimated $19.3 billion to taxpayers over the next five years by eliminating a tax subsidy that was arguably necessary during you know, wind power's nascent 1990s, but is no longer necessary. Uh, opponents counter that the production tax credit helps both the environment and the economy simultaneously by lessening America's reliance on fossil fuels while also supporting and creating jobs in the renewable energy sector. Well, let's just say passing this legislation won't be a breeze. Breeze? Yeah, because it's about wind power? <laughs>